Hello, welcome to Al Jazeera America. I'm Rochelle Carey in New York. Here are our top stories at this hour. World leaders in Iran say yes to an agreement that will limit the country's nuclear program in exchange for some relief from economic sanctions. This is the most significant development between Washington and Tehran in more than 30 years of differences. Iran's president and spiritual leader have responded positively to the deal. Some Iranians, however, say they had hoped for greater sanction relief. After four days of deliberations, Afghan leaders have endorsed a security deal with the United States. Under the agreement, American security forces remain in Afghanistan beyond 2014, mainly to train security forces. Lawyer Jurga is asking Afghan President Hamid Karzai to sign the agreement by the end of the year, but Karzai says he needs more time before he signs on the dotted line. Thousands of Ukrainians are out on the streets. They're protesting the government's decision to scrap a trade treaty with the European Union. The Kremlin wants Ukraine Ukraine to join a Russia-led customs union and threaten to retaliate if it went ahead with the EU deal. And the Vatican has unveiled bones believed to be the remains of St. Peter, the very first pontiff. The nine pieces of bones were discovered under St. Peter's Basilica in the 1940s. I'm Rochelle Carey. Sky Dancer is next. Keep it here throughout the day.